So it was all her fault. You guys really are all cut from the same cloth. <laughs> it's a very expensive cloth. Well, you should know by now that if she said you did it, then you did it. Hashtag me too. Don't try to defend yourself. That's my job. All we need is to put reasonable doubt in the mind of the jurors. How? We stick to our narrative. You met Miss Thomas in the bar. You slipped her the key to your hotel room. Sweet. To your suite. She went up, let herself in. You were in bed, of course. You had another drink together, made mad passionate love. You fell asleep. She left in the middle of the night. That's exactly what happened. She also left with some of your personal evidence. This is a setup. It's extortion. Well, that's up for the jury to decide, which is my point, Grant. So let's establish that she had a few drinks, but wasn't drunk. She was lucid when she came into your room, so it was consensual. Then she left at some point, making a premeditated choice to grab your towel on her way out. And the jury's gonna believe all that. I'll paint Miss Thomas as a high-end escort, working hotel bars, preying on rich businessmen like yourself. Boom. End of story. <laughs>